two more people in Hawaii have died from COVID-19, bringing the statewide death toll to 29. Both of them were residents of Oahu. Jim Beniza has more. Both casualties were elderly Oahu residents with underlying health conditions who were hospitalized at the time of their death. The Department of Health says that these deaths should be a reminder to everyone at just how quickly COVID-19 spreads from person to person. Today we received the heartbreaking news that two more of our neighbors uh, passed away due to COVID-19. An elderly woman and an elderly man are the 28th and 29th casualties of the virus. The female um, was an individual who was, who was hospitalized, who was at a, a, a Pearl City nursing home before, uh, before uh, she passed away. Anderson did not confirm if the woman was from the same Pearl City nursing home that experienced a cluster of cases in mid-July. According to the Department of Health's state epidemiologist, Dr. Sarah Park, the man's death is linked to an existing cluster. The passing of this man really demonstrates how rapidly and invisibly COVID-19 is spreading through our communities, particularly on Oahu and particularly associated with clusters. A close contact of this individual attended a spin class at a gym taught by a person linked to the Hawaiian Airlines cluster. In a statement, Hawaiian Airlines says that they express their deepest sympathies to all who have lost friends and family to the COVID-19 pandemic. They confirmed that 17 Hawaiian Airlines employees contracted the virus during a training program. The man's death marks the second link to that cluster. Jen Boniza, K2 News, working for Hawaii.